Avenue. Near Amity Road, you'll find what will soon be a divided bridge. It's under construction to get rid of the low water crossings. Frank Granieri's farm is located nearby. We live in between it and the flood of 98. We were in there for four days. We couldn't even get out. But there's a big problem. Crews discovered an unauthorized landfill after the $7 million project was already budgeted and cleared to begin. When we began excavating, we found about a 9 foot to 10 foot thick layer of municipal solid waste that encroached about 500 feet into our right of way. County commissioners approved a little more than $453,000 to get rid of the landfill. The assumption was is that landfill was on the private property north of our right of way. So it wasn't until we actually got in there and started digging that we found out it was encroaching in our right of way. The nearly half million dollars will come from savings from other completed projects. But some taxpayers question why it had to come down to this. I would think they research the area before they do something like this. Rick Gonzalez works out in the area. He says he knew of the landfill. From my understanding, it's been here back in the 50s, I think, 60s, somewhere around there. How did you know about it? Uh, just through history. Will anybody get in trouble for not seeing that at first? No, because actually there was no there was no surface visualization that the that there was encroachment. And you know, you're talking about an unpermitted landfill that's more than 30 years old, so you know, the the limits of it were not necessarily recorded.